Hell yeah, I quit today. <laughs> Probably the best decision I ever made too. Why the hell would you do that? I told you to stick it out for just two more months. V, 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 v. I couldn't do it anymore. You and I both know that boss of ours is a damn problem. I couldn't even stand looking at his ugly ass face again. I definitely understand, but. But what? You know you, bro. You know you feel the same way too. Come on. You work. You work close with the man. You should know that better than anyone. What the hell was that? Yeah, that was Nelson. <laughs> hey, bro. Hey, he'll be alright. <laughs> Hopefully, what I did gets everybody else to leave too, or better yet, get his stupid ass fired. They're not gonna fire him. He's too valuable to the company. Yeah. I know. But he doesn't deserve to be, though. Do things just because he's the boss and that he went to some preppy ass school that he has the right to make the people who work for him feel so, so damn useless. That type of stuff is just downright evil. So what's so funny? Um, nothing really. We were just talking about something that happened. Yeah, it wasn't anything too crazy. You know, it's funny because y'all are steady, you know, joking around, but I know y'all need this job. Hey man, we're on something too crazy. Hey, hey Rodney, um, you need a car, right? You're trying to save up to get a car, but you're always late. Bianca, you're in debt. Your dog's hurt, but you're always on the phone. Preston, you're trying to rap, but your bars don't hit. We didn't even do anything. Why are you treating us like this? Because I don't think you guys bring any value to this company whatsoever. I mean, the last option I have, honestly, is to fire you guys. Unless you can help me out with something. You're definitely not wrong, but Jason, you're going to be dealing with people like that at jobs everywhere. You just got to go fix in for that stuff. What? Forget that. Is that what having tough skin is now? Taking constant disrespect and doing nothing about it because all right, that ain't right all right whatever you say well at least you got your check before you left i know nelson's the type to mess with your money so <sighs> i'm gonna just stretch it out till i get another job or something comes up i don't know but i know that since money's gonna start getting low i know i'm gonna need to make rent and you know, try to stretch out the food that I got, too, so. Just do what you can. Yeah. How much did you end up getting anyway? I know I got a whole lot because of me working my ass off these last two weeks, too. Matter of fact, let me check. Oh, no. What? What's wrong? I, 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 I can't find my check. No, 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 no. I remember having it on me. I remember having it when I... Damn it! Where is it? <sighs> I left it in the vest. Oh, no. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Is it, is it still on the ground? Nope. Hey, um, V, you know, I, 
you know, I was wondering if you could probably go, you know, and That's illegal. Damn. Just call him. No, 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 no. I am not talking to that man. You already know me and him on bad terms. And dude is weird. Okay, just text him then. Do you want to get evicted? Do you want to go back to having nothing? Damn, fine. All right, I just sent it. Damn, he's already replying. Sounds like he's been waiting for you. Like I said, dude is weird. Alright, he said to meet him at some location. He sent the Addy. Alright, bet. I'll come with. Bet. On my way. See, I knew he picked some weird ass place, bro. Like, look at this. Does that not look weird to you? Relax. It's probably gonna be just a simple grab and go type of thing. Shouldn't take no longer than 30 seconds. Like, bro, look at this dude, man. It just, it looks like he's plotting something. And pl why is he wearing that? I've never even seen him wear something like that before. I honestly don't know. He wasn't even wearing that today at work, so. See, the, I don't know about this, man. Something doesn't feel right. I don't like this at all. <laughs> you ain't lying. So, you better hurry up and get your check. Nope, nope, not doing that. Wait, nope, what? forget it. Look, I'm not liking this at all, so I'm gonna just go home, I'm gonna get in my bag, and then go get my money back up. That's all no, I can okay, do, so that's Jason, what- Jason, whoa, chill. Stop being so scared. Okay, you put in a lot of work at this company, and after everything that you've been through, you deserve it more than anyone here. So, get your ass out of this car and get your money. Yes, ma'am. Come on, go. Hey, Nelson. Um. Um. Yeah. Um. Thank you for coming out here, um, meeting with me. I, I really appreciate it. So, you know, I just, you know, I just really need the check. So I, I truly appreciate you coming out here and, you know, meeting me and everything. Cause I'm
Wait, what the hell is this? Ronnie, Bianca, y'all in on this too? Hey man, it's time for you to pay for what you've done. What the hell are you talking about? I ain't never... Nelson, that's my check. Bro, give me my... Ah, 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 ah. Look, what do you want from me, man? I have not done anything to you. On June 2nd, 2020, around 3 a.m., all my personal achievements, along with my PhD, were stolen from my office. And the next day, it was found in the dumpster behind the company building. Would you happen to know anything about that? What makes you think I did it? You know, I did some research into you, and you seem like quite the troublemaker before you came here. All right, look, man, that's, that's not me anymore, okay? Vandalism. Robbery, burglary. <laughs> I mean, how can it not be you? I said it's not me, all right? Look, I ch I'm, I'm a different person, okay? Well, if it isn't you, who is it? Wait, that's that's it? Wait, that's, that's all y'all have? The fuck you... That's a dude running in jeans and it's a blurry picture. How can you tell that's me? I mean, that's all I needed. You came to Talzon in hopes to get back on your feet, but then you met me. You got mad. You got jealous. You knew you couldn't have what I have, and that's why you did it. So just go ahead and admit it. Admit it, Jason. You know, my life is already a living hell. I got this job so I could turn away from the person I used to be, better myself. But for some reason, you just don't understand that. Obviously, everything in your life was either handed to you or you had access to it. But no, since some of us don't have that luxury, you know, some of us actually have to go above and beyond just to make ends meet. But instead of being a, a, a boss that understands that and tries to work with us, you instead make our lives worse than they already are. You wouldn't be shit if you was in our position. You wouldn't last one fucking minute. You think it's because of jealousy? I quit because you're a terrible person. Hey, <clears throat> Jason, I, I, I didn't know it was that get, tough get, get, give me, Just give me my damn check. Rod and Bianca, y'all might as well quit with me. Y'all don't deserve this. Plan B has started. Well, damn, that took a while. Yeah, I know. But. <gasps> yes! Nice! You know what I'm saying? Hey, hey, <laughs> no, I'm saying, no, I'm saying. <laughs> so, why did he do all that? He, uh, assumed that I broke into his office and broke all of his trophies and achievements and destroyed them, so. Ooh. Why would he assume that? He found out about my past, and because of that, he thought that I was jealous of him. That's just wrong. You? 
out of everyone <laughs> no nah, that's just crazy that out of everyone that works there that he would pick on you why you I did it what I destroyed his trophies why Because I want to prove to him that just because you have achievements does not give you the right to be an asshole. I swear, I don't know why people are like that, but they get a little bit of success, a little bit of achievement, and they let that go to their head. And then they think that just because it comes easier for them, they have the right to be like an asshole. And it doesn't make any sense to me. So you were jealous of him? No, what? No, no, never that. It's just... I just wanted to prove to him before I left that that's not the right thing to do. That's not a right, that's not the right type of person to be. And I was hoping that also it would help other people leave because I know that he has a grudge on people, a hold on people, and that's why they can't leave the job in the first place. So I just want to prove to him that nobody deserves that type of treatment. But honestly, it's fine if they don't see it. I'm on to better things anyway. Oh shit, shit. Come on, that's it. We, we gotta go. We gotta, we gotta go, come on. What is he talking about? I'm sorry. What is he talking about? Thank you.